guys, welcome to News and Highlights. I'm your host, Jordan from Alter Element Games. And today, from Kotaku, we have news from Ubisoft that talks about, well, Assassin's Creed Unity has been pushed and delayed till November 11th. They gave us the actual release date, and it's kind of, uh, well, not underwhelming, but, uh, you know, kind of predictable, really. I'm not really upset about this, you know? Uh, another delay from another big title game? It, it happens in the uh, industry, and, you know, hopefully the game will be better for it. And, uh, you know, a lot of people are waiting for this co-op thing to happen, and it's really, it's really good. You know, I haven't seen a, dis uh, a difference in Assassin's Creed since, you know, Black Flag, and... I really love that title, as you see me here playing Assassin's Creed 2, doing it up with Ezio, you know, I'm a, I'm a kind of a big uh, Assassin's Creed fan myself, but, uh, you know, I'm more of a Prince of Persia kind of guy, and all in all. Um, well, let's see, for what the news that we have here today, they said that, um, quote from senior producer Vincent Pointbird says, it's always hard to be precise and to quantify exactly how much work is involved. So as we get close to the finish, we often realize we're near the target, but we're not quite there yet. So with that phrase, that's pretty awesome to hear. Um, also, they are working on, with uh, Assassin's Creed Rogue for the uh, Xbox 360 and for the PS3. So for those two titles coming out simultaneously at the same time, you know, I feel that it's just it's just protocol. You know, you, you want your games to be nice. And everybody's complaining about Assassin's Creed being the same over and over again. Well, hopefully this push and delay will actually make it a little bit better. Have some extra features. Fine-tune some things. You know, when I played Assassin's Creed Black Flag, I might do a review on it probably in, uh, in the next month or two. Uh, when I was playing Assassin's Creed Black Flag, the actual uh, parkour and sprinting was kind of uh, glitchy and buggy. It wasn't as smooth as uh, predecessors before. Um, they really simplified the mechanic by just making it just the uh, right trigger. You know, uh, hopefully it's more precise with this new level in France or in Paris. So hopefully everything connects well together. Hopefully the mechanics are fine-tuned to the point of, well, damn there, precision. Like, th that's the news for today. Hopefully this game comes out good. I'm a huge fan of Black Flag. Rogue looks awesome. Kind of, uh, Templar kind of view of the Assassin's Creed. Kind of reminds me of GoldenEye Rogue Agent. So uh, hopefully this will be a better title than that game actually was. Like and subscribe to my channel and uh, I'll be back with more news and more reviews later on this week. Alright, thanks a lot guys. And as always, thanks for watching my videos. Have a good day. Peace.